Hey everybody, I'm just going to report another week of progress in my plants and uh, in my indoor container garden. Uh, vegetables, not drugs. But um, anyway, as you can see, my lettuce is still coming in. I thinned it out again and made a little pile in the bottom left corner there. Um, but otherwise, you can see the plants have more, you know, in some cases up to four leaves on the plant. Um, but, um, you know, most of them have three, but they still seem to be growing and getting bigger. Um, I started using two liter soda bottles um, for containers. Um, they seem like they'd be the, the perfect container for onions. Um, so I cut off the very top and leave about oh, 11 or 12 inches. And I'm going to try some white onions in there, some other stuff maybe. But in that top one, um, uh, a couple nights ago, I planted a white onion. In that one, I planted a, two green onions, and that is one of the transplanted white onions from that pot. There used to be four white onions in there. I moved one of them out of there into there. So now there's three white onions and a bunch of little green onions. The green onions are the little uh, grass-looking things. Um, they don't, it's not really looking very good or that impressive, so we'll see what happens there. Um, I did get my seed order in from uh, Seed Saver Exchange. So I decided to plant a rooster spur pepper in that milk jug, and we'll see if that's enough space for it and if what happens with that. Um, my green beans are doing very well. Um, I'm up to um, multiple, you know, new sprouts of of leaves on on most of the plants. I've got the big leaves at the bottom, then several, you know, branching off of the leaves. Um, in my seed order that I got from Seed Savers, um, I got a tomato. Um, one of the well, I got two tomatoes. One of the tomatoes I got was a Cherokee Purple tomato, and that's in that uh, large 14-inch pot. And hopefully, that will uh, come come along pretty soon. They're supposed to be really, uh, really good-tasting uh, tomato. It's a little bit colorful, not the standard red. It's kind of a, a purplish red kind of coloring but anyway um, I've stopped moving them into the bathroom um, I bought this lamp um, <coughs> excuse me I bought this lamp but the lamp is only uh, right now it's only got a uh, 27 watt or 100 watt equivalent um, but it is full spectrum it's got uh, the color temperature is 5500 K and uh, which is pretty cl darn close um, it would do great. This would be great for flowers and great for that kind of stuff. But it's just not quite. Uh, it's not enough water. Just not quite bright enough to do this whole vegetable thing. Um, and the color temperature I'd really like to be 6,500, not 55. Anyway, the lamp's going to stay, but the bulb in it is going to be replaced um, in the next probably two weeks. And I'll really need to get that replaced by the time the tomato and the pepper um, get to the size of those peas. Uh, or those beans, um, I'll have to have a better lamp, or they won't they won't fruit right, and it'll just be I think it'll be a disaster. So I've got till probably next paycheck, and I'll order the light next paycheck. Um, but this is really my setup where everything's going to be. I'm allowed to have space from right there at the end of this lettuce up to the corner of the door there on the bottom left. So that's pretty much my space that I can take up right there and like I said it's gonna it's gonna be crammed um, eventually but we'll see I'm gonna probably build some build kind of a stand to get them off the ground um, anyway there's the lamp again and like I said it's got a hundred watt um, equivalent uh, uh, full-spectrum bulb in there and the plants seem to like it really well um, oh and there's the window it's about four in the afternoon so as you can see, the light really does start to dim out after about four. So anyway, that's all for this week. It's uh, been a busy week, and I'll hopefully be able to plant the rest of my seed saver seeds. Uh, here, uh, probably next paycheck, I'll be able to get some more pots and uh, and uh, see what we can see what else we can grow with this, and, and hopefully we'll get some some good stuff off it. Anyway, take it easy. Bye.